Have you been smoking? Are you seriously going to grill me about that right now? What's wrong? Nothing. Have I done something wrong? She's pretty. Who? Laura. Yeah, <laughs> Laura. I think you described her as whatever. <laughs> I don't remember. Why don't you tell me you're going to LA with her? She wasn't in LA with me. We were just there at the same time. Michael, you haven't told me a thing about her before tonight. I think you know that. What's that supposed to mean? What did you think was going to happen tonight? Did you think that, I mean seriously, that I wasn't going to notice? Why would I think anything about you noticing her? You are a terrible, terrible liar. Maybe because I don't lie. She likes you. And you like her, and I get it, but you don't, you don't want to talk to me about that. Where's this come from? My eyes, Michael. She was the only one that you spoke to all night tonight. How many glasses of wine did you have tonight, Joe? Two. And a few sips. You had more than that. What yeah. are you? Well, the wine patrol. You know that moment when we go out and ask you not to have another one, you ask me why? This is why. <laughs> You've got to be kidding me, right? Because it makes you like this. Michael, if it wasn't for the wine, you'd be in a lot shittier place right now. I mean, that's what, like, fucking 11 hours a day, maybe five, six days a week. Oh, what's that? Let me count that. 60 hours. Oh, with her for over three months now. What does he think I've done? Check my phone, Joe. Check my email, my receipts. Go on. Not everybody gets caught, Michael. Has she, um, has she told you that she's attracted to you? I don't know. Maybe Joanne. You know, I don't know the conversation go there. I bet it tried to though, right? I bet it tried to go there when you are in LA together. You have all these hours that you know that I don't know about with people that you work with. You go away doing your articles all the time. And have I ever given you a reason to stand there and feel the way that I feel right now? I mean, I looked through a window tonight, Michael, and I saw something that I just did not need to see. You, you couldn't have just watched yourself and spared me this? I haven't done anything wrong. You're trying to pick a fight. Are you going to Philadelphia? Is she going to Philadelphia with you and uh, Andy tomorrow? Yeah, she's been working on the Monroe property with us. What? What's the look? That look is sad, Michael. There's nothing going on, Joe. Nor is just someone I work with. Uh, I don't. I don't blame you for being attracted to her. I mean, she's attractive. And let's face it. It's natural to crave a newness. Then what are you blaming me for? For going out of your way not to admit it. I thought I just did. I don't do that face, Jerry. You know what I meant. You corner me and you order me to admit something and pounce on me the second I cave. Where are you going?